Mm, we got an interesting question here to find out the derivative. It is uh, cos of the angle sine 3x square plus 2. Right? And here sine is another again trig ratios and whose angle is 3x square plus 2 means we have to do here three times we need to differentiate here. First we have to differentiate for the cos right and then we have to differentiate for the sine and then we have to differentiate for the for the angle that is the main angle that is 3x square plus 2 right so it will be more like it will be a fun it will be very interesting so let's let's find out now derivative again in the same way as we used to do in the previous videos all right so let's suppose this is my function y which is cos sine 3x square plus 2 all right so here my main function is cos cosine and then sine and then this angle all right so let's differentiate both sides with respect to x so dy over the dx and now cos sine it's in the bracket 3x square plus 2 all right with respect to dx but but uh, here at cos here you know cosine has the power 1 and uh, angle is sine 3x square plus 2 but here it is x so we cannot we cannot uh, differentiate it so we have to work here and we have to differentiate with the angle of that and cos has the angle here now sine 3x square plus 2 so I will be differentiating this cos cosine uh, cosine uh, sine 3x square plus 2 with respect to the base this I'm uh, marking where alright so it's derivative of cosine uh, sine 3x square plus 2 alright with respect to its base that is sine 3x square plus 2 not not with respect to its angle sorry it's not base it's angle all right and again times since I have, I have put from my side I, I have to multiply with the same thing sine 3x square plus 2 and again again see sine has the highest power here 1 so we have to differentiate again with the with the base of, with not the base with the angle of this and angle is 3x square plus 2 so so here will differentiate with its angle 3x square plus 2 right and again here 3x square plus 2 we have uh, we have put here we have divided from our side so we have to multiply it also so it will be 3x square plus 2 divided by and now we can differentiate this easily with x right so it's a simple algebra equa uh, equation or uh, function we can easily differentiate with x because x is the main variable here and now see how easy it is just differentiate this uh, cos and then sine and then this one so let's differentiate one by one here derivative of the cos angle uh, I think you know derivative of the cos theta with respect to theta is minus sine theta so doesn't matter if theta is something else here instead of theta in this equation we have this sine 3x square plus 2 so doesn't matter it will be minus sine and now angle angle is here uh, 3x square sorry angle is this sine sine 3x square plus 2 all right and we are finished with this now let's work on this part again sine theta derivative of the sine theta we should write okay derivative of sine theta with respect to theta that's cos theta so it doesn't matter if theta is something different instead of theta here we have 3x square plus 2 so it will be again cos 3x square plus 2 that's it and again now let's walk for this part and here we have derivative of 3x square plus 2 now 3 is a, a number so it will come outside and this uh, this x square derivative of the x square will be 2x and the derivative of this constant 2 will be 0 right so let's rearrange it properly this all things so 3 times 2 it will be 6x alright and minus is here so let me put the minus my pain is blinking I don't know what happened okay so again cos 3x square plus 2 oh come on it's moving so so much anyways uh, it is now sine again in the bracket sine 3x square plus 2 it's 2 alright okay and it's a bracket again and this is my derivative of the given function dy over the dx so it's it's very easy it was initially looking something uh, complex right but it's it, it was a fun it was very interesting to find out the derivative first we find out the derivative for the cos then for the sine and then for the 3x square plus 2 
so when we find out the degree of the cos then we uh, we differentiate it with the with the angle of this and when we differentiated the sine we differentiated with the angle of this and when we differentiated this 3x squared plus 2 we differentiated with its variable so keep in mind keep in mind what I said right sine like trig functions we differentiate with the with respect of its angle and algebraic function we differentiate with respect to its main core variable keep in mind right this will definitely help you in the next video catch you in the next video goodbye